đúng nơi về Man, uh, here it's already um, Saturday night. It's probably early Saturday morning where you guys are. But anyways, uh, the day was a very interesting day. I started off like this. Uh, one of the guys who work with here that's doing some stuff for us said, Hey, I want to take you guys to the temple. So we went to a uh, Buddhist temple and saw that and walked 365 steps up and did all that. So today we went to a Hindu temple, and I was very curious because you know I've never ever you know seen a, a Hindu temple. But we couldn't go all the way inside. But there was one area that we did go through that was very interesting. Uh, and what was going on there was they were actually having funerals, but they had the bodies there, and the people had the bodies in the water. And they were washing the bodies in this water, this river that didn't look so clean. And the family is taking the water from the river and throwing it on a dead body. Then they'll take the dead body and they'll put it on this fire and they'll burn the body. And this funeral was just like an ongoing process. I mean, it, it probably was like maybe four or five bodies there. And up, up on the hill, they had these babas. And babas are like these religious guys uh, who dedicate their life to religion, but they smoke hashish. And they live like right there. And this is what they see every day. But I said all that to say this. It, it, put, it put things in perspective for me as far as you never know when you're going to pass away. You never know when the last breath will leave your body. And having said that, that means something. Make sure that all your ducks are in order. Um, make sure everything's in order. Before you pass away, if you can, don't waste time. It just it just put in perspective for me that you never know how much time you have, and the little time you have, uh, as far as to do the things that you want to do in life and take care of the things you want to take care of in life, it's time to do it. Because think about it, you know, we as Americans. We are very materialistic. We got to have this. We got to have that. We got to have the nice car. And then we struggle after that because we really couldn't afford it in the first place. And we spend our time wasting money and time and valuable time buying all these things. But we haven't built our empire. <coughs> we haven't left a legacy for our family. You know, uh, by hard work and saving and leaving things for them and, and trying to do our best. So it, it just... It was just a lot of thoughts that were running through my mind today that helped just put things in perspective for me that it's time now. Don't waste any more time. Do the things you want to do now. When you when they come to your mind and say, I need to do this or I want to do this in such and such time, you're working on borrowed time. Do it now. That's 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 all I have to say, you know, and whether whatever that is. Whether that's opening a new business or going to school or getting a degree or doing something that you're afraid to do, do it today. 
So I just want to leave you guys with that YouTube. So uh, thanks for listening and hope everybody's going to have a, a happy, hol happy holidays to those who celebrate things. So, uh, okay, we'll take care. This is called Japanese hot pot. Yes. <clears throat> you put the chili powder inside. Yeah. You put chili powder. Some people put the chili powder. Mm -hmm. How do I get them? <laughs> you gotta big, get your noodles. I in. got big problems with my noodles. How do I get noodles to stop? Stop. Stop. It's like never ending. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah.